everyone! For today's video, I'll be doing a Q&A vid because last time I asked you guys what kind of video you want me to upload. So I just wrote them because I cannot use a phone because I'm using it as a camera. Okay, so first question from Therese Lienar. Sorry, I don't know how to pronounce your name, but she asked, How old are you? I'm 16 years old. And daming nung sasabi, hindi daw ako 16. Maybe because of my height and... So yeah, I'm 16 years old. Next question from Anne Jeff Bro. She said, Hi, I miss you. And this is a random question, but how tall are you? Hi, Anne. I miss you too. To answer your question, my height is 5'4". And honestly, when people see me in person, they're like, Wow, you're so tall. But for me, personally, I don't think my height is really that tall. Gusto ko pa to mga 5'7". Ganun. Next, by Lozada Jana. Anong grade nyo na po? I'm grade 10. I'm currently junior high school student and still alive. Next, by Sombilio Lal, what is the first thing you notice about a person? Well, physically, the first thing that I notice about a person are his or her eyes. Pero pag hindi naman physically, I notice um, his or her attitude, like the way he treats other people. And his or her aura, like if he or she is giving good vibes or negative vibes. But first impression pa lang naman yun, and that can still change. Next, from Carl Galang, senior high school strand. Next school year, my strand will be STEM. Another question from Carl Galang. What is your dream job or profession? My dream job or profession is to become a doctor someday. But honestly, when I was a child, being a doctor never really crossed my mind because I was so afraid of blood. And I didn't really like the surroundings at the hospital. But as I was growing up, I felt like God was calling me and I was destined to become a doctor someday. So next question from Karil, that's CYG. Paano po dumami yung subs nyo? Nagsisimula pa lang po kasi ako sa YT ate. Good luck on your YT career and I'm sure you're gonna enjoy it as much as I enjoy doing it. And to answer your question, upload frequently, consistently, and just be yourself because that's what the viewers like to see on your YouTube. Just don't give up on your passion. And yeah. Okay, next question. Sabi ni RJ Pangilinan, ano yung pinaka down point ng buhay mo at paano mo to na overcome? Honestly, yung pinaka down point ng buhay ko are those times where my anxiety will always kick in. It was the hardest part of my life, yung wala kang gana sa lahat. And I felt like I was not me. It was so hard to become genuinely happy. And I overcame those struggles. Siyempre, una, I prayed to God and surrendered everything to Him. I realized that being happy is not a result of something. It is, it comes from within. It is a choice that you make. Like no matter how hard your situation is or no matter what struggles you're facing, you still need to choose to be happy because at the end of the day, it is you who's gonna suffer more and the people around you. And you don't want that. You don't want to become a burden to anyone. But yeah, that's how I overcame it. I just prayed and consistently chose to be happy no matter what. Next, from Julie Rafanan, what is your favorite color? My favorite color is pink. Also, she asked, when is your birthday? My birthday is May 28. Next, from Anna Jane Maniago. Paano mo na-overcome yung fear na humarap sa maraming tao nung pageant? Actually, yung pageant na sinalian ko sa school, that was my first time. And fun story, yung kakastart pa lang nung pageant, hindi lumabas kami sa backstage. Siyempre, required na smile. Nanginig talaga yung labi ko na like, I was smiling. People don't really see that Maybe hindi long sa nay mag smile ng matagal because the pageant started almost 2 p.m. and ended until 7 p.m. I think. Basta matagal. And yung fear na humarap sa maraming tao, um, I don't really know all my schoolmates. I think that's a good thing because the moment that I, I was on that stage, my technique. During that time, I ko na lang na I was alone modeling and I think I succeeded. I overcame the fear of 
big, being exposed to a lot of people because actually I was very shy before. Also last year ko na lang din naman sa school namin, so I just did it and faced everyone and just enjoyed the whole pageant. Next is from Jandria Louise. What is your favorite life advice? Actually, I have two favorite life advices. The first one is you don't have to be great to start, but you need to start to be great. Ako kasi when I have to do something or when I want to do something, it's very impulsive ako. Like, I'm really gonna do it. But at the same time, I'm also that kind of person who procrastinates a lot. So I just think of that life advice that I need to start doing something. And kapag naman nagsimula tayong gumawa ng mga bagay, hindi naman kailangan agad na magaling. Um, what's important is that you're willing to start doing it. The next life advice that I love is the speech that Miss Universe 2018, Catriona Gray, said. Um, she said that on your path, you're never denied and only redirected. I apply that life advice every time I fail in life. Honestly, before, failing or being rejected is really one of my fears in life. But I realized that you have to fail sometimes. Failing doesn't mean that you're worthless. It doesn't mean that you're not valued. It doesn't mean that you're not good enough. It just means that maybe God didn't answer your prayer or He didn't give what you really want to have because He's preparing the best for you. Yun yung inisip ko every time I fail. Like, I'm just being redirected to something that is really meant for me. And yeah, those are the piece of advice that I'll really apply my whole life. Next is from Carlo Pangan. What is your ideal boy? Honestly, I don't have an ideal boy. I don't have standards. But I do appreciate someone who's honest, consistent, and willing to make an effort. Next, from Deng underscore Nick Dao. Ano ang gamit mong skincare kung meron pa share naman? Yes, I'm actually planning to do a skincare video. Maybe after this one, I'm gonna film a skincare video because a lot of you guys have asked me um, to make a skincare routine. So maybe after this one, I'm gonna film a skincare video. Next, from Atasha Gavara. What is your favorite food? Grilled crab, seafood, and chicken. I just, I love crab so much. Okay, next. I think this will be the last question that I'll be answering from underscore Ayla. Ano po ma-advise nyo sa mga nagbabash sa inyo? Shout out po ate. Love you. Love you too, Ayla. Um, honestly, I don't have any advices to my bashers, but thank you for taking your time and effort to criticize, I think. I don't know. Just God bless you. Yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. And I hope you guys got to know me a little better. And comment down below what other video ideas you'd like to see from me. Except for skincare routine. Because I'm gonna do it soon. I promise. And that's it. See you in my next video. Bye!